are three characteristics of a VIE that might result being consolidated into the parent. One, the parent has decision-making or governing control over the entity, even though they don't have the ownership. That might result in that VIE getting consolidated. Another is if that entity incurs losses, then that parent has to absorb those losses. Basically, it's funding the entity, even though it doesn't look like it has the controlling ownership of that entity. A third example is the parent has the right to receive residual income. Basically, they have a preferred benefit from this entity so here are some questions you want to ask when you're assessing whether you have a variable interest entity. Why was this entity created? What is the purpose of the entity? Uh, you want to examine the design or redesign of any entities. What are the terms of the contracts between the entities? Who owns, who has interest in both those entities? Are there similar investors on both sides? What do the governing documents of the entity say? What do the formation documents say? 